One, two, birds. That's that? all I wanted out of the day, so. Yeah. I'm Whitney Avalon, I created Princess Rap Battles, and I play Leia. So we're doing Hippie Hop at Humper, and then... That's it. Princess Leia is an easy pick. She's cool, and we'd like to really, we'd love to see a rapping Princess Leia, because I think she has a lot to be pissed off about. Calm down, Grandma, you're ugly when you're mad. Showing off your dark side, you remind me of my dad. Leia is opinionated, strong, and sassy. That's why she's cool. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> if you're going to have Princess Leia, I think you have to go against the other big trilogy. So we went with Galadriel from The Lord of the Rings. It's trilogy versus trilogy. I think Sarah Erickson is awesome. She's a joy to work with, and I adore her. I look better in white. You should flee from my sight. I'll strike you down like Obi-Wan, because I'm colder than carbonite. My friend Jim Klimek played Pippin the Hobbit. Jim is a... Uh, trained clown, he's a mime, he's a juggler. He was juggling and climbing trees and falling off of things without hurting himself because he's a stunt professional. He was eating grapes. He would pop up behind people and in front of people. We had a shot where he somehow wandered onto my team's side and then realized he was lost and went back to the other side. <laughs> that was great. We just sort of let him run wild and let the camera roll. So yeah, I was like no, really. instant famous, you know? like. I saved the world. I thought it would be funny and unexpected if Princess Leia had her own slave layers. You're like a stormtrooper because your shots never hit. I wore one gold bikini and the world lost its shit. I'll rap faster, outlast her, outclass her, surpass her. We kept having to cover cameras with plastic and put umbrellas over our actors. One must fuck me. <laughs> you will love me and despair. That's in your hair by the time I end this line. You will love me and despair. One of the challenges we have is we wanted to recreate the Star Wars blaster sound. We needed to do it right. We weren't going to take the sound from anywhere. So you suspend a slinky so it's just off the ground, and you drop the bottom of it, and there's a sound that will resonate up through the spiral. And between the metal and the air, it'll make that cool sound. We have a ton of fun on set. We're on movie number seven while you're still on your six. Yes, but unlike you, we don't pretend that three don't exist. You're like a stormtrooper because your shots never hit. I wore one gold. <laughs> Break it off, come on. <laughs> Is this a space for the force, guys? 